Hello, good people. This is Van Est JC, Jim Van Est, coming at you from TraderRetreat.com and now BoxOfficeProfits.com. As you can see, I've got a new review box in my grubby little mitts. That is Bowman Baseball. Uh, so we are going to go ahead and bust this open for you and uh, tell you what we think of it. Um, Bowman Baseball is a... Uh, it is a, a lower end, for lack of a better term, set. Um, what you'll find is Bowman Baseball will have the first 150 cards are your veteran cards uh, that are paper cards, so to speak. And then the last, or the next 150 cards are all prospects, and they are chromed. Um, so that's pretty cool. And um, we're going to go ahead and jump right into it. Uh, we are promised uh, one autograph per box, so we'll be looking out for that. Uh, first off, I wanted to give big shouts out to Tops for sending this out to us. And then uh, also shouts out to Trader Retreat and Box Office Profits for sending it to me. So let's go ahead and take a look at these first cards. Um, uh, Oswaldo Arcia, Minnesota Twins. See there, looking good. It's a good looking card. One more, one more base. And here we've got a Chrome first Bowman card of James Dykstra. You see the Chrome. I mean, the Chrome is, is sharp. Uh, for uh, what's really kind of a lower end set, price about sixty bucks a box or a little less. Um, boy, they, they don't they don't skimp on the Chrome. The Chromes look really really good in these sets. Uh, so that's pretty awesome. Go with some more base. We've got a Bowman Scouts Top 100. Uh, this is a chromed card, and this is Albert Almora. He's number 86. 100, so that's an insert set there. So there's 100 of those, obviously, for the 100 cards. Um, Nick Petrie, Bowman First card. And then... Chrome. I gotta be honest. This kind of looks maybe goldish, or it could just be the background. I don't know. Of uh, AJ Cole. Nice looking card. Not numbered. Um, there are a ton of parallels in this set. Purple, blue, green, gold, printing plates, all that kind of good stuff. Um, I am going to, as I don't want to take up all night with this break because it's 24 packs of cards, uh, 10 cards each. Uh, so it could be a really long night if we're doing everything, um, you know, and, and showing every card and taking a lot of time to go through everything that we got here. Um, Gary Sanchez card, and, and I'm sorry, I, I was incorrect. The, the first 150 cards are veterans, the next 150 cards are prospects. Uh, but it doesn't. It looks like any card can be chromed. Uh, chromes are essentially just a parallel of what we got, and it's looking like we're getting all about three in a pack. If they go with the uh, or silver rather um, lettering. It's really kind of hard to to read uh, some of the names of the cards on, on the front. Uh, Tyler Kolek. Chrome, very nice looking card, and here's uh, one of our first inserts. It is, uh, I can't read it, uh, a Ramel Tapia, he's Colorado Rockies. It's an iced mini, numbered out of 150. You see the icing going on in there. I'm going to flip it over and get to the 150. Very nice looking card, nice numbered card, we like those. So what you're going to get in this set, uh, as always, is a lot of prospects um, and a lot of first cards. Uh, so it's it's a good um, you know it's it's a good way to get some of the first cards of some of the bigger superstars. Uh, you know if you if you're going back and you're finding things like old Jose Abreu cards or something like that out of Bowman uh, that would have been two or three years old, um, they're pretty uh, they're going to be pretty dang popular right about now. Uh, and here is another mini ice. This one, not numbered. So let's see if we can see the difference in the two. Oh, very, very simple. This is a blue, blue bordered and a regular bordered. So it's the blue bordered numbered to 150 and a regular mini ice, which is not numbered at all. 
Uh, so we're gonna not, we're gonna rip through these, and then we will be posting up an extensive review at our new digs at boxofficeprofits.com. Um, I it, while it's not a trading site, uh, they are being very generous in letting us post our stuff up there. So I hope that you're you're liking the new digs and liking the new content. Um, here is a purple parallel of Nick Trevieso from the Reds. Purples are number two, 250. You see the purple around the outside and the gold numbering on the back. This one happens to be number four out of 250. You see that? Uh, so we, we like the parallels. We like the opportunity to get rainbows. Uh, they're always good. Uh, so yeah, so in the comments of the YouTube video, or if you want to reach out to me on Twitter, at, uh, it's at VanNessJC uh, at Twitter. Would love to hear from you guys to see what you think of the new digs and the new reviews and, and everything and see what we could do that would make it better for you. Uh, you know, would love to have you reach out to us and let us know. Um, here is a... It's not numbered, so this is a... This might just be a foil parallel because it's not chromed. A silver ice. Now they say these are one per uh, one per box, so that must be what this is. A silver ice of Teoscar Hernandez. So very nice looking card right there. Um, that'll get us through our first quarter of the box. Um, in six minutes. We're gonna try to knock this out a little faster, guys. Um, it, with with sets like this, there's not. A whole lot of variety. There's not a lot of inserts. There's not a lot of hits uh, to be going through. It's it's base, base, and chrome uh, with some parallels uh, included, like this purple parallel of Giovanni Urshela. This is not a chrome. This is just the paper, uh, which they're calling a paper now. Uh, paper parallels uh, rather than chrome parallels, or you know, as opposed to chrome parallels. Um, be careful, some of these cars do stick together. DJ Chisholm, first Bowman card. You know, I've been opening Bowman for a few years. One of these days I have to go back to some of my old Bowman breaks and see who else's first card I've got and see if I don't have some gems in there. Because you know they exist. Um, you know, these guys you'd never heard of at the time, then all of a sudden they're the next, you know, the, the next stud, Kyle Lloyd, Chrome. Another top 100. This is Matt Olson. Top 100. He's number 71 on the scouting top 100 list. Sure would be nice to see some higher number on the top list, huh? But uh, again, we'll be posting the written review up with scans and detailed accounts of the break. Uh, I'll let you know how many of each thing we pulled in our break. Because uh, I know everybody likes to know that. Let you know about the, the duplicates if there are any. Hopefully there won't be. And, uh, yeah, we'll break it all down for you like we do. Uh, another another mini ice of Daniel Norris. This is the farm's finest. Now, uh, every one of these sets does have autographs. Um, there's dual autographs, triple autographs, but let's face it, this is a one autograph per box. Chances are you're just going to get a base auto because that's 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 what this product is about. It's uh, it's selling right now. I'm looking at it on a on a website at 56 bucks a box or 57 bucks a box. Um, if you're spending 57 bucks on a box of cards while you're you know while you're wanting to get good stuff out of it, it you're not buying it for hits. It's just the way it is, and uh, and and everybody understands that. Um, so you're probably you're likely going to be looking at a base autograph. That's what I'm looking for. Uh, but just so you know that anything, any of these minis and any of these other kind of little subsets, they do all have autograph versions. And uh, you know maybe uh, maybe for your 57 bucks you'll get lucky and pull one. Uh, heck, maybe for mine. Uh, well, uh, for my box I'll pull one. You never know. But we will uh, keep an eye out for them. Whoa, Moise Alou. Is this uh, Moise Alou Jr.? No. Huh. It's just a... It's just a... Oh, it's a rookie card flashback. Check that out. An old Moise Alou 
rookie card flashback from the Pirates. Sorry, kids, it's it's late at night, and uh, you know I'm I'm working it out. <laughs> I know I, I get <clears throat> I get YouTube comments all the time about how my breaks suck, and uh, you know it is what it is. We just uh, we do our best. I try to give you as much information as I can about the product that we're opening, and uh, yeah. Uh, I am much better with the written word, I think, than I am uh, anything else. First Bowman card of Chi Wei Hu. Pitcher. And on to our third stack. And we're still looking for our elusive autograph. Only one in the box. So we should be uh, coming up on it here soon, I would think. Maybe it would be one of those sweet mini ice autographs. That would be pretty neat. One of those top 100 autographs. I believe they have autographs as well. And here we go. A top 100 of Matt Whistler. San Diego Padres. He's number 98. Um, like I said, it'd be cool to pull like a, one of the top 10 or top 5 or something. That'd be pretty neat. But we will just keep going. See what we get. Oh, Clayton Kershaw. First woman card, Trevor Gott, the Anaheim Angels organization. Uh, another. There's a paper ice, I guess, of Lorenzo Cain. Or foil parallel silver ice, maybe. <coughs> Not too bad. Sorry guys, it's taking so long. It's it's a lot of packs, a lot of cards to go through, and when you're flipping through a lot of base, and frankly the cards are sticking together and everything else, uh, I'm just full of excuses, aren't I? You gotta love it. Anyway, another mini ice of Julio Urias, farm the farm's finest is what these little minis are. That's what all the minis are, is farm's finest. Uh, we do have the blue one in there. It's numbered to 150. We found a couple purple cards in here, numbered to 250. Um, you're also going to find some silver, numbered to 499. Some green, numbered to 99, though you're likely only going to find those in retail. Um, gold, numbered to 50. Orange, numbered to 25. And now those are going to only be in the hobby boxes. Uh, you're going to find red, numbered to 5, and then blacks, numbered 1 of 1. And then, of course, printing plates uh, for all their cards. David Ortiz. And just again, this they're just calling them paper now. So when they've got the chrome and the non-chrome, the non-chromes they're calling paper. That's just kind of nice. It just gives it a, a term that we can throw around. So I can sit here and tell you that I pulled, uh, you know, 150 paper cards and <coughs> however many chromes. Anything else they know? The Minnesota Twins. Eric Haas. Right there. And last one in this quarter of the box. Those are three quarters of the box done. Let's see how we're doing. Still looking for that elusive hit. Ah, there we go. There's a good little parallel. Um, need to get down to it. It is an orange parallel. I mentioned that they were orange. This is an orange parallel of Jed Giorco, San Diego Padres. Uh, we're going to go ahead and put them up there so you can see the orange parallel, orange border on the card. And uh, the numbering is 21 of 25. It's going to focus, no? 21 of 25, that is a nice little, uh, nice short printed uh, parallel there. We like that. Tim Cooney from my St. Louis Cardinals Chrome. And here we are to the last stack. <coughs> last quarter of the box. Let's see what autograph we pull out of here. You know, there's some good stuff in here. Uh, so I'm, you know, you can always hope that you that you land one of them big ones. Adam Wainwright. Oh, there goes my stack of cards. Let's start a new stack. And it's a 24 packs of 10 cards a pack. So you're going to be coming out of this with 240 cards when it's all said and done. Uh, it's a 300 card base set, so um, you're not going to be scoring a whole base set in your box. 
uh, because frankly, there's just more cards in the set than there are cards in your box. Uh, so that's good. Tops and Bowman are usually very good about um, about not duplicating everything and giving you a whole bunch of duplicates in your box. Um, we will give you the numbers when I do have the written review, uh, but I would figure that to be the case here. Uh, there are no that I can find uh, relics in these boxes. Uh, it is just autographs are the only hits you're going to get, um, which is kind of nice. I mean, uh, you know, relics had their time, uh, but they've kind of worn out a little. <coughs> Another Farm's Finest Ice. Uh, this one, Justin Nicolino of the Miami Marlins. Gotta like the little mini cards. You don't know what to do with them when you have them because you don't have a case for them, but they're still pretty cool. I'm down to just three packs left. Still looking for that hit in the box. Should be coming up any time now. Victor Reyes, first Bowman card. You know, like I keep saying, one of these Bowman cards, one of these first rookie or first Bowman cards, is gonna be big one day, and I'm gonna be glad I got his card. Gordon, Jay Bruce, Luis Lugo. There is our autograph. Finally got to it. Second to last pack. And it is a first Bowman card. Uh, it is a Chrome. It is a Brewer. Name is Jorge Lopez. And it is a beauty. Um, get right up on it. It's on the card. Um, nice blue signature filling up the space. Nothing going off the edges actually almost legible and uh, again uh, if you didn't hear me it is on card we like the on card autos as opposed to the sticker um, and now we're gonna bust open this last pack and see what it has uh, in store for us um, let's see da, 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 da. doesn't look like anything major no parallels or anything like that Cliff Lee Sonny Gray finish us up um, and that will do it 24 packs, 240 cards busted out for you. Lots of chrome, lots of ice, lots of color, and uh, it's a very nice on-card auto of Brewers Hurler Jorge Lopez. Um, again, this has uh, been Jim Van Ness, Van Ness JC, rip, ripping this for you. I look forward to uh, getting a review up for you guys. And again, at Van Ness JC on Twitter. Uh, would love to hear what you think of the new digs and the new reviews. Um, again, thanks to Tops for sending the box out. And thanks to Trader Retreat and Box Office Profits for getting it to me. Until next time, kids, Van Ness JC signing off.